Hey guys, today we'll go over the pluses and minuses of the 2016 GMC Yukon Denali. I'd also like to thank Auto Nation Buke GMC Park Meadows for allowing me to do this video. In order to start your Denali, you just keep the key fob inside the vehicle, put your foot on the brake, and hit the button to start. First, the parts I like about the vehicle. First, the styling. I think it's handsome, classy, and mean, especially in this crimson red tint coat. Second is the engine. It's a 6.2 liter V8 producing 420 horsepower and 460 pound-feet of torque, which is an immense amount of power, and it makes the Denali extremely fast. Third are the power folding second and third row seats. It just adds such a level of convenience to the Denali. It's just so awesome. Fourth are the TFT display and heads up display. They add such a level of luxury. And fifth are the ventilated seats. I love ventilated seats, especially on a 90 degree day like today. Now for the parts I dislike about it. First, I just see it being a very hard vehicle to park and pull out of a parking spot. And especially in a tight, crowded city, it could be a big inconvenience. Second is the abysmal MPG. It gets 15 city, 21 highway, and 17 combined. I admit it's much better than the previous generation, but I don't think it's quite there yet. Third is the quality. Although I do realize General Motors quality has skyrocketed in the last few years, I just don't think it's perfect yet. Fourth is how uncomfortable the third row can be. The floor is so high that my legs and knees are way too far up. But overall, I love the new Yukon. I think it's come so far. Make sure to check one out for yourself. Alright everyone, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Alright, 